Ladies, we don't wear perfume for men, but smelling good, you're gonna attract some dudes, you feel me? This is not for play. We don't do this for fun. I just want the world to know that I'm that girl. Pretty black cute, uh, pretty black cute, pretty black cute, pretty black. New camera, who this? This new camera is uh, really doing what it's supposed to do. What's popping, y'all? It's Najra Iman. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hey girl, thanks for stopping by. If you're not new, hey babe, thanks for coming back. Today, we're gonna be talking about all things perfume, all things fragrance, all things smelling good because it's so important to smell good. Like I know we emphasize looking good, but we gotta smell good too. They're equally as important. So I wanna put y'all on to my favorite perfume, layering combos, my favorite lotion is just all to smell good. Pretty girls don't gay key. No, we don't. We put each other on to the best products, period. These perfumes and layering combos are guaranteed to have somebody follow you across the street trying to figure out what you got on. Disclaimer, this might attract unwanted attention, but you know, you can't put on like a sexy perfume and not expect somebody to be attracted. So without further ado, let's get into it. I have my handy dandy box of all of my selected perfumes for this video and like lotions that I picked up. Now, I'm a gourmand girl, so I like stuff that's smells edible, stuff that smells sweet, stuff that smells like warm and delicious. I don't, I don't really care for like earthy, musky, no, I want sweet, I wanna smell like a bakery, okay? That's the goal whenever I put anything on, I wanna smell edible, get enough to eat. So basically what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna show you a perfume and I'm gonna show you what I usually layer it with, whether that be lotion or just another perfume or body mist and you guys can do what you will with that information, okay? So the first perfume layering combo, I talked about this in my How to Smell Good Every Day video, but it's so simple. It's literally just Victoria's Secret Amber Romance Body Mist, Amber Romance Lotion. Victoria's Secret is a pretty good place to start if you're new to like the world of fragrance and especially the world of layering because they have full collections of lotions and matching fragrances, body mists, perfumes, whatever. I love this one. It makes me smell like brown sugar and vanilla. It smells so good. So this is the first one. I'm pretty sure these together is like $30, so very affordable. This next combo is a bare vanilla from Victoria's Secret. I feel like I wear this combo the least just because it's not my favorite, but when I want to just smell like vanilla, simple, don't want to smell too intoxicating, I'll put this on. Like if I want to go to the store or something like that or class and I don't want to choke anyone with my scent, I'll just wear this. Okay, my next favorite perfume to wear is Black Opium Extreme. I've tried out the original Black Opium and honestly, I like this one better. I know that half of the female population thinks that Black Opium smells like grandma. The other half thinks it smells delicious. I'm that other half. I think Black Opium smells chef's kiss. If you don't, like I really think your nose is broken because it smells so good, especially this one. It's just a mixture of like coffee and vanilla. That's what I get, coffee, vanilla, and it smells so good that I literally keep these Dossier dupes. I keep them on me. These are the Amory Vanilla perfumes from Dossier. Y'all know that I stand Dossier. Everything Dossier does, I'm a fan of. They can do no wrong in my eyes. I love a good dupe house, and they love me so much that they always send me perfumes, so I love them because they keep my fragrance addiction fueled. Like, they do enable me. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like Dossier is a really good fragrance house for beginners. If I was just starting out dabbling in perfume or whatever, I would definitely shop at Dossier. So if you guys are beginners, I definitely recommend Dossier. My coupon code is Anaja10. You can use that at checkout and get some money off and just go crazy. They also recommend layering combos to layer with the perfumes that they sell. So I don't know, just a little finesse fragrance fact. I'm getting sidetracked. With Black Opium, I rarely, rarely wear this alone. I usually wear it with vanilla wood. This is just a super, creamy, pure vanilla scent. It's so good. Like it makes me want to scream. <laughs> this combo really brings all the boys to the yard. And I'll be trying to put everybody on this combo right here. It be having a dude who's really like chasing after me. Like it's really a man magnet. And ladies, we don't wear perfume for men, but smelling good, you're gonna attract some dudes. You feel me? It's scientific. The reactions I be getting when I wear this is just insane. Perfume terms. Siage is like the perfume trail that you leave. The siage that this combo Leaves is so intoxicating, y'all. I wore this to school one of, one of these past few months. I was standing in one spot, just like on my phone or whatever. The guy, he walked by me. He turned around. He's like, "You smell amazing." I was like, "I know." <laughs> Actually, I'm gonna show you guys how I usually wear. So, I'll take some of this Amber Romance lotion. So, I'll put some of this lotion on. I'm sorry, y'all. My new camera has like this viewfinder on top. So, if I keep looking at the top, please forgive me. Okay. I'm Adjusting to a new camera. So, apologies in advance. Alright, so I'll take the uh, 
lotion. And what I usually do before I even put on any perfume is put on some Vaseline, but I don't have any Vaseline with me right now. It's downstairs and I don't feel like getting up. So I'll take the perfume. I'm gonna go right in with Vanilla Woods and put that right on top. And it just turns the black opium extreme into this sexy, sultry, like, I don't even know how to describe it. Y'all gotta go try it for yourself. Listen to me when I say this. You will literally smell like the best person in the room. This next layer ring combo is super popular, but who cares? Brazilian Crush, Tiderosa 62, and then the Sol Janeiro Bum Bum Cream. Mmm. -hmm. Mm, I clearly need to go get more, but uh, yeah, I'll be using this. It's giving pistachio, it's giving caramel, it's giving beach babe, it's giving I want to go to Brazil right now and soak up the sun while drinking a pina colada. And then bonus, 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 bonus. I live for this. Cherosa 62, Killian Princess. Yeah, those girls, those girls. When I wear this, I am that girl. I mean, I'm already that girl, but when I wear this, I'm like that girl times. 3,000, it's not a game. Perfume layering is serious business. Don't get into this if you don't want people chasing after you. I'm just, ugh. Killian Princess, Shadow 62, with either the Bum Bum Cream or Amber Romance lotion. Princess is basically like a green tea, marshmallows. Trust me when I say that this combo is just, she's not to be played with and you will just smell like an angel, a whole angel. I just got this new bottle. I don't know why they changed the bottle. So this is the old bottle. They reformulated the bottle. Don't know why they did that because now this just looks like a less drippy version of this bottle. It completely lost its swag. I don't know, what do y'all think? Do y'all like this bottle better or this bottle? I feel like this looks like a cologne bottle. Like this has so much personality and spunk and this is just like bleh, but I don't know. Amazing. Um, this honestly gives me like, it gives me princess vibes. Like the name is so fitting. Go try a sample of this. I think it's on the price of your side. I 100, nearly 200. So I recommend getting a sample before you try the full bottle because perfume collecting is a bit expensive. But if you know how to like finesse, you can smell as good as the rich girls on a budget. Shopping at websites like microperfumes.com, which is a, I mean, it's in the name, microperfumes. They sell tester samples, mini um, travel size sprays, twistedlily.com, which I do have coupon codes for that I'll link all in the description box. There's Lucky Scent, you can go to Sephora and ask for a sample. Like there's ways to dabble in this life without fully dabbling in this life. Okay, before I continue, I'm just gonna say that there is a common theme. I know I said that I'm a gourmand girl. My favorite scent is vanilla, so I like smelling like vanilla. Most of the perfumes I own have a vanilla note in them, so this might get a little redundant because I just love vanilla, but you can never have too much vanilla. I like to wear this vanilla cashmere body cream from EOS with mix bar, vanilla bourbon, a vanilla balm. Like, this is more of a smoky vanilla. This is more of a creamy, pure, caramely vanilla. They work very well together. Compliment magnets. Again, like, I literally don't wear perfume for compliments. I wear it for myself, but hey, I'm not gonna be mad if somebody wanna tell me how good I smell because I don't wanna, who don't wanna hear that they smell good. This is like $20 at Target. I think I got this for eight from Amazon. Probably the most affordable combo in this video. So don't sleep. The next combo that I like to do is vanilla cashmere. Again, this Nest Madagascar vanilla oil that I actually just got for Christmas from Chate. Everybody say thanks, Chate. Thanks, Chate. Well, it's not focusing, whatever. And then, ooh. Every time I get a whip, I just want to hug myself. Full lavender from Dossier. This is just a dupe of YSL Lee. I used to have the full bottle, but I sold it because I didn't like how strong it smelled, but I realized that all I had to do was layer it with the vanilla to kind of neutralize the lavender and bring out the vanilla, but I sold it before I got a chance to do that. But luckily I have this dupe and, and it literally smells the same. So after layering, layering it with a vanilla scent, it just smells a lot less mature and like cologne-y. I feel like the lavender makes it smell like a cologne, like a mint fragrance, um, but after adding the vanilla, it smells just a lot more feminine. Okay, honorable mention, I also use this cocoa butter. I got this from Victoria's Secret a few weeks ago when they were having their sale. I think it was like $7. They are having their semi-annual sale right now. Not sponsored, but this just smells really good, like coconut. And I usually just pair this with the vanilla perfume. Or I'll wear this by itself because it's so strong, surprisingly. I bought this Laura Mercier Amber, Amber, Ombre Vanille, however you pronounce it. I bought this 
for myself for Christmas because the girls be raving about this, honey. They be asking me, this is the best thing since sliced bread. So I was like, I need to give it a try because I'm just obsessed with vanilla and also amber. Girl, why does it smell like bum bum cream? Just way more expensive. So $72. Bum bum cream is like $20 to $40. And I'm sitting here like, what is so special about this cream? That smells just like the bum bum cream. Somebody lying. Anyways, y'all, that is all the combos that I have. Feel free to try these out. Let me know what you guys think if you do end up testing any of these combos out. I hope y'all take some of my combos and actually use them and walk into any room smelling like the best bee in the building period but yeah y'all so i hope y'all enjoyed this quick little video i really just wanted to come on here and share my tips with y'all my comments with y'all because again pretty girls don't get key but yeah i hope y'all enjoyed this video i will talk to y'all on my next one love y'all bye get in your bag sashay sashay away pretty for what